Hello everyone and welcome back to my tutorial and today it's not tutorial this is actually like overview or like a trailer so I will start to show you how you can render your object I mean the, your project project in 3d max so but we will use the corona uh, actually corona and vray it's pretty same uh, the most of the nodes and the parameters it's same in vray and in corona but anyway i will use the corona so if you want to follow me just go and download it it's uh, 30 days it's uh, for free and just check it so let's back to the, our project uh, i did uh, this project in uh, revit you can do in sketchup whatever just load inside to the 3d max uh, i created here the plane and i load some one of the type trees and the grass and we will speak today about how to create environment so this is really incredible question uh, because most of you thinking like uh, to create environment in something uh, it, it's really hard no guys it's really fast as you see we have on here only the uh, grass and trees and sky done so we will do the same thing now so uh, we will start from the back i mean the from the uh, last thing we will create the sky let's go to the i will delete now all materials here we don't need that and uh, first what what I need I need the sky right so let's go to use bitmap and now uh, we're uh, I mean the 3d max asking us like where we can uh, what you want to load so I want to load my uh, HDRI maps I will leave the link to this HDRI maps below so let's load it up uh, this one yes this one where is it here and i know it's uh, um, actually this is like a cube so let's change the tiling and let's make it a bit bigger and now i just applying this bitmap map to this environment let's apply it and i will show you what we will change i will start my interactive render of course now i have some problems i will um, i will back after that as you see we have now this map it's working pretty well so this is what i what i need actually it's um as you see it's so highlight let's change this this thing it's actually pretty easy i uh, of course you have the thousand ways how you can change it i'm using this way i'm sorry if i'm wrong uh i'm using this way maybe six even maybe four and as you see now now it's more more cool than before no one it's totally small two maybe four let's leave it like a four okay awesome and as you see we i have now problems uh, with the texture because this is texture come from the rabbit so how we can fix it actually pretty easy uh corona can change it automatically by this button that's it just few seconds and as you see now everything working so what's going on with the my let's let's check it something broke with my tiling I will try I will try to do it again mm -hmm. let's rotate let's do it again yeah it's much better something was wrong it's uh, happened sometimes because we changed the materials uh, with converter so we should do it before but uh, i did it wrong sorry guys uh now what i want to do i want to change my uh, the camera so uh let's choose the camera and let's choose this one too and what i want now i want put it a bit higher 
like this and that side I mean the camera I'll place it here so let's uh, let's start our interactive render again and as you see our camera is changed but it's not right place let's try more maybe like this no more and a bit like this okay and now we can see uh, the light it's not not enough maybe I did it uh, bad maybe let's make it say 0, 06 it will be better or maybe 0, 08 oh 0, 08 I see it okay we will live on the 0, 08 so what the next uh, next this is about the lighting uh, I mean the Sun let's create the Sun I will create it here like this and like this now of course it's wrong because our Sun it's not like in uh, in, it in like a Lumion so I will put it there maybe a bit here and I'll change it to the 0 0.55 oh not 55 it's too, too much like this why not so okay we finished about the lighting and about the sky so now we will start from the modeling this is really fast so I'll try to explain you fast uh, let's say you want copy uh, you want copy the grass first right so for the copy the grass what we need we need we, we need create the corona scatter so go to here find the corona and corona proxy first we will create proxy from this object choose this this uh, new object go to property and pick from the send so we want pick from the send this one I will save it few seconds done and let's do the same thing with the tree that thing uh, now I'm choosing that one pick from the sun and this tree and of course you should save it few seconds done okay now we have two pro proxy object now we of course need corona scatter corona scatter actually will uh, multiply it to the our um, plane so let's go inside to the uh, corona scatter uh, let's choose the object where we will place our objects and let's choose our grass and now i will multiply our grass like uh, maybe 20,000. let's try it i think it will be enough as you see now we have the grass really fast right so the other thing we should use again the corona scatter but uh, to the our tree but my tree is will be located here of course you have the two ways you should you can do it manually but uh, better if you will do it um, automatically and without like with randomize I mean so but how you can do it pretty easy so first I will go to the plane and I will find the modificator vertex where is it vertex paint here I will increase my size of brush like 20,000 and I will use the brush and let's draw it here you cannot see now anything but you can see now as you see the black side oh sorry I mean the other one black side it's uh, where not will be any object but I want put on the white side so it's like this as you see on the white side will be the, our trees and let's check it uh, okay okay now let's go to the materials we will find the modificator vertex color it's here okay and as you can see the map zero let's check here which which is the map I will change to the map zero now let's make it like map map tree here and map tree here 
Okay, awesome. Oh, it's four. Let's change to three. What the next? Uh, choose Corona Scatter. Let's go inside to the settings. And here you will find... Oh, we need the other one, Corona Scatter, sorry. Because I don't want to mix up. Here the other ones, Corona Scatter. Again, we need to use this plane. And now these trees. And as you see, it's everywhere. This is wrong. Let's go down. And here you will find the map. Let's make it instance. And as you see now, our trees only in this side. And I will change now the count to the 15 maybe. You can see it's changing here. So now 15. Uh, even maybe 15 it's too much. Uh, no, 15 it's not too much. It's, it, it is what I want as you see. So we will live like that, but I will change only the one thing, as I said, uh, about randomize. Here you can see rotation. So I will change the rotation from 0 to, for example, 120. And as you see, now all the trees uh, rotating uh, the random uh, randomly. And I will change the scale of this object from the 60 to 150. And as you see, it's different now, different objects. And here you can see it's also different objects. Just uh, leave five seconds. I will back when uh, it will pass, uh, I mean, when it will render a bit better. As you can see, uh, now our environment is really cool. Of course, we can use the uh, much, much more the types of our uh, grass or trees. But now I'm using only one type of the grass and one type of the tree. And now we have the really nice uh, the environment. It's not about our building because uh, <laughs> I didn't spend the time for this building. Even for the building, I can apply some materials and it will be look more better. Let's I will show you. I will stop now with this render. I will go to the materials now. Uh, what type of this material? Some color wall. Mm, nothing special. So I can actually use some uh, Corona library materials. And let's use some concrete from the Corona. Let's find it. Mm, here the concrete. Let's say I'm so lazy, right? And here the some concrete sample. Let's use it. So I will select that one and I'll say I want select similar. Okay. And I will apply for that one, that material. And for that one, I'll say also select the similar and I'll apply this material. Now I want the about the glass. Let's find some glass here. Here the glass, and I want some mirror glass. I will do it by mirror, mirror, mirror. We don't have any mirror glass. I will do it now. So let's say I will use, for example, glassy, glassy, milky. Mm -hmm. I will use, for example, this one. And let's create a mirror. Like glossness, reflection. everything it's I think all right and let's like do it like this and where's my transparency here Maybe 0 0.8, 0 0.6. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is a little bit better. And let's apply to our glass. Select similar. And let's apply to the glass. Okay, and let's try to render it again. Now I will render uh, normally. So I can use the uh, Shift F and now I can see what exactly I will render. 
let's go to the render setup and let's start to render it i will back when it will finish so after a few minutes uh, like one minute and 50 second okay it's less than two, two minutes you get really nice uh, environment uh, even not bad your building okay i will say this is bad building because we should spend more time for modeling detail without detail your building is just a cube N even texture not will help you so what i want to say you uh now you know how to create environment if you are interested about that i can go to more deep i can show you how you can manipulate that how you can apply a few materials not only one so uh, i will start to show you how you can work in 3d max and corona too but we still will use the revit models so you will uh, make like workflow you creating models in Revit and you'll transfer you can, in 3D Max just you spending one one hour there and you will get nice render. So if you are interested about that, just thumb us up, leave the comment. If you are not interesting, uh, so it this is will be just quick overview. Thank you guys for watching and see you soon. And that's it from today, thank you guys for watching, don't forget to subscribe my social media, leave some comments for this video and give some like and see you next time.